Well, Democratic Congresswoman Diana DeGette is in Denver today, and she is focusing on saving DACA. You remember that President Trump announced the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals, as it's called. That program would be rescinded. That was back on September 5th. DeGette just wrapped up a morning press conference. Amanda Del Castillo joins us now. And Amanda, what is her plan? How does she want to help dreamers? Well, really, she really is pushing to have that bipartisan DREAM Act on the House floor right away. Now, we know that other than to get today, we heard from DACA dreamers as well as uh, those educators who come from that DACA program, all of them really focusing on what they believe is the need to extend DACA protections, an extension of the ongoing fight you're seeing right here on your screen. And they discussed what impacts it could have on local communities if protections are eliminated. Some background on the DACA numbers, there are 800,000 so-called dreamers across the U.S., with more than 17,000 right here in Colorado. And today, DeGette is pushing House Speaker Paul Ryan to put the DREAM Act on the House floor again right away. The bill would essentially provide a path to citizenship to undocumented immigrants, meeting a list of specific requirements. And in the next 30 minutes, we're back here detailing exactly what was said in DeGette's 1015 press conference. I'm live in Denver. I'm Del Castillo, Denver 7. Well, the University of Colorado Law Legal Clinics is offering some free DACA clinics to help as many people as possible renew their applications before that October 5th deadline. The sessions will be held today, also next Wednesday. There are three locations where Dreamers can fill out applications. The first one's in Boulder at the law school there right on the CU campus. The event goes uh, on today until 4 o'clock. The second's going to be in Fort Collins. That's on the CSU campus. That event runs until 6 tonight. And finally in Greeley on the UNC campus, that event also goes until 6 tonight.